What up YouTube, it's Boogie. Today's video, I got a Celebrations Elite Trainer Box to open for you guys. So, uh, it is verified authentic from StockX. So, um, it gets this seal that says verified authentic. People, uh, sellers send it in to StockX. StockX uh, checks it to see if it's authentic and it's actually legit and real. Then StockX ships it out to you after they verify that it's real. So I do li like getting from StockX for that specific reason. But um, I was waiting for this box for a while. I ordered it, I think, over a month ago. And uh, I was waiting for the seller to ship it to StockX because after they ship it to StockX, StockX still has to verify it and make sure that it's authentic and then they ship it out to you afterwards. So um, I waited about a week. I think it takes three to five business days for them to have to ship it out. So I waited about a week, maybe a little longer, and uh, the guy still didn't ship it out to StockX, so uh, I uh, made a call to StockX, and uh, well, I didn't make the call, I actually had to message them, but I messaged StockX and they uh, sent me over a new box, and it took me maybe about, I'd say a little over a month just to get this box. But it did get here and I am grateful for that. I'm happy that it came in no problem. I know the, uh, so Shadow Calyrax VMAX or Alt Art is good in this set. That's like the Chase card. And then also the Ice Rider Calyrax. Those are the two Chase cards. So I have Steel Energy, Agatha, Frog Crystal, Fionia, Porygon, Swirlix, Sneasel, Snover, Blitzel, uh, Snow Runt Reverse Hollow, and the rare is a non hollow Saws Buck. So I guess, I guess uh, with the sets that came out this year, the one that I kind of, well not really avoided, but I kind of like, uh, I kind of like wasn't too enthusiastic about picking up packs for them and trying to um, collect for them was Chilling Rain. So when I saw them in the box, I was like, you know, kind of sucks that I got like four of them when you know I got a variety of different packs in the last box that I got. So I got fire resistant gloves, cast form, rainy form, snover, Valerian your mask, coughing, shuppet, reverse hollow rock rough in the rare. There's another saws buck. And also, I believe the pulls are really hard for Chilling Rain. I think even harder maybe than uh, the pulls for Chilling Rain, I think are even maybe harder than Battle Styles. So I have Fighting Energy, Karen's Conviction, Echo and Horn, scoring a uh, single strike scroll of piercing. Diglett, Golet, Deerling, Sneasel, Farfetched, Reverse Hollow Dug Trio, and a Spirit Tomb. Then 
that's chilling rain and then we'll get into the vivid voltage. Uh, psychic energy, uh, flannery, cobominable, single strike scroll of piercing, shuppet, squall vet, sphiel, swirlix, uh, galarian your mask, uh, cast form snowy form in the rare, is a delay, not hollow. See, that's uh, one of the reasons Chilling Rain is not one of my favorites. The pulls are so hard to get. I got four packs. I didn't, I didn't get one. Not even a, not even a rare hollow out of any of those. get through this pack and then we'll get into the celebrations i'm excited for the celebrations <laughs> so i got a water energy swallow league staff charmeleon c dot pick pick a pack mud bray joltic weedle glaring me out and the rare is a non hollow elect uh, elect all right so we're gonna get into the celebrations cheese cards probably for celebrations uh most of them i have for the immediate collection but uh for the delta and classic classic uh delta and classics types i need um I need a lot of them actually. I need a lot for the Delta. And uh, when I made my Detective Pikachu video, I mentioned that I really like how, I really like how that when they come out with sets, they really have like new ideas every, 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 uh, Every set they come out with, they have really good ideas about coming up with new ideas for like what the new Pokemon are. And um, and um, I mentioned that in my last video, but also with this set, I really like how they brought this back to like all the older older sets because a lot of people don't haven't been able to see a lot of these probably people that are just getting into the collecting like even myself i, I really haven't seen a lot of the sets like uh the luxury I, I hear a lot of people are really liking the luxury in this set Nice, we got a flying Pikachu V. I think there's four Vs in the, the, uh, the I don't think it's called the subset, but like the, the official set, like the first 25 cards that you collect for the set. I think there's only four V cards. The two, uh, the Zacian, Zamazenta, and the two Pikachus. Uh, flying Pikachu and Surfing Pikachu. I'm sorry, I'm trying to match these up while I talk to you. Guys. Oh, nice! You got a Tapu Lele right off the bat. Second pack in, I think. Second pack in, we got a Tapu Lele. This is supposed to be one of the uh, more sought after cards, I think, because of the. The uh, playability of the card is a very good um, card to battle with. That's 
really nice card. And we got Professor's Research. So the chase cards are probably, I, I mentioned the chase cards earlier, but I'm so excited to get these open. Uh, chase cards are part of the Charizard and I still haven't pulled the new. And here's another clay doll, that's a beautiful card. To me these cards look like stickers, like the glittery, like holographic in the background, they look like stickers. And then we have uh, Pikachu. Zamazenta. So I was kind of bummed out that the, the, this box didn't come in when it was supposed to. So I gotta admit, I did buy some single cards, like uh, single cards for the set. I was getting worried that we're gonna go like I was getting worried that they were gonna be hard to get harder to get so I kind of uh, bought singles to try to complete the collection a little quicker nice we have a surfing Pikachu V Max. Right now, for the for the set for the original 25, I'm missing the uh, flying Pikachu V Max and the Mew Gold card. So obviously, the Mew Gold card I would love to pull, and that Charizard definitely is a chase card for me too. I have the Venusaur and Blastoise. So this is Yveltal. Kyogre, and then in the classic collection, nice, we got a Dark Gyarados for the classic collection, pull. I do have this one already, but this is packed fresh, so I'll probably just keep this one too. And we got a Professor's Research. left so we have a Veltal a Kyogre the classic collection card is a hot o so I didn't get a classic collection full and I got a Mew We have a 
have a Lugia, a Groudon, a Classic Collection, another Dark Gyarados. Hmm. Uh, that's interesting. I got two of the same card in the same box. I guess that's common. There's so many of, I mean, there's so little of the set. I guess it's easy to double up on some. And then we have another Mew. Last pack guys, let's wish me luck. Last pack whack or last pack magic. We have a Lugia. Either way, I'm happy to open these packs for you guys. And for myself, I'm just happy to have these sets. It makes me so happy to open these, these specifically. I've been waiting so long to open the celebrations. I only was able to open one ETB. So waiting for a month just for this to come in, I was happy to open this. And we have a Yabelton. And a Lunala. Do the recap of the pulls. I think I got all of them. Yep. Also the Pikachu in the corner. So I got a Dark Gyarados, Flying Pikachu V, another Dark Gyarados, Surfing Pikachu V, Zamazenta V, Playdoll. And a Tapu Lele. Tapu Lele, probably the, the uh, best pull out of this, in my opinion. But that was a great opening, guys. I'm happy with the pulls I got. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell to let you guys know when I come out with new videos. And till next time, guys. Peace.